Hi everyone, Assalamualaikum. Welcome back to English with Teacher Mal. For today's lesson, I will teach you English Year 4, Unit 1, Lesson 2. Let's start. For today's lesson, you can refer to your textbook Get Smart Plus 4, Unit 1, Where Are You From? Page 8. I will show you some pictures of today's vocabulary lesson and I want you to repeat after me. Okay? Number 1. Ice skating. Again, ice skating. Number 2. Ice skate. Ice skate. Number 3. Play chess. Play chess. Number 4. Football. Football. Number 5. Play badminton. Again, play badminton. Now, I will read you a text and I want you to listen and read together with me. Please pay attention to the four words which are Always Usually Sometimes And Never Okay? A day in the life of a figure scatter, Megan, nine years old. Megan usually goes to the ice skating rink at half past six in the morning. She goes to school at a quarter to eight. After school, she does her homework. Megan sometimes watches TV after dinner. She always goes to bed at 8 o'clock at night. A day in the life of a chess player. Pablo, 10 years old. Pablo goes to school at a quarter past 8. After school, Pablo doesn't go home. He always goes to the chess club and plays chess. He usually goes home at 6 o'clock in the evening. After he does his homework, Pablo has dinner. He sometimes plays chess on his computer. Pablo usually goes to bed at 9 o'clock. Okay guys, if you listen and read the text of Megan and Pablo that we have gone through just now and I did ask you to focus and pay attention to the four words which are always, usually, sometimes and never. Always, usually, sometimes, never. Okay, these four words talk about frequency. What is frequency? I will explain to you the meaning of frequency in the form of timetable. There are four types of activity in this table. Say this is your daily activity. So how frequent do you do that particular activity? We have football, play chess, badminton and ice skating for Monday until Sunday. Now, I'm going to show you the number of ticks. If each day is going to be tick, then the activity is done for that day. Okay? Let's see for the football. Wow, football have 7 ticks, which means you play football every day. For the second activity, there are only 5 ticks, which means 5 times a week. For the third activity, play chess, there are only 3 times a week. And for the fourth activity, ice skating, there is nothing inside there, not even one tick. So how do we describe the frequency of our activities in a week? If we do an activities every single day, 
without fail, then we can use always. For example, I always play football every day. If we do some things very frequently, but not every time, we can use usually. For example, I usually play chess. For badminton, which you play only three times a week, not even half of the seven days, so we can use sometimes. For example, I sometimes play badminton. For ice skating, since we never play ice skating from Monday to Friday, so we can use never. For example, I never play ice skating. Do you want more example? Okay, let me show you some. Alright, example number one. Hamdan and his friend always play football every day. Ruhila usually plays chess after school. Aisha sometimes play badminton with her brother. Razali never play ice skating. Alright class, that's all for now. But before we end our lesson, don't forget to subscribe my YouTube channel, English with Teacher Ma. See you in our next lesson. Bye!